It is five years in prison for a 36 year old man who punched and killed a father of six at a West Fargo concert. Tomas Cervantes pleaded guilty to manslaughter in the death of Ricardo Balboa after initially claiming that it was self defense. The victim's widow gave emotional testimony about the impacts that Cervantes has now left on her family. Not only did you take my husband's life and destroyed my kid's future, you also destroyed your daughter's life. Court documents say Balboa was punched by someone and when he turned around to see who did it, he was hit in the face, knocked unconscious, fell and hit his head on the concrete floor and then died. The man who shot a woman and led authorities in Pelican Rapids, Minnesota on a 48 hour manhunt back in April will spend at least 15 years in prison. A witness told police the victim was in the kitchen cooking when 36 year old Futhasa Prethane burst through the door and started punching, kicking and eventually shooting at her. She had an active protection order out against him. He was arrested two days later after a high speed chase in Redwood County. Prethane took a plea deal and was sentenced to 15 years for attempted murder and five years for burglary. 28 year old Joseph Case of Grand Forks has been sentenced to serve 40 years in prison for gross sexual imposition involving a child. Court documents say last June the mother of the eight year old victim told police that he called police to report this rather. Now the man later admitted to touching that girl three separate times. Still to come this Tuesday morning, gunmen at a kid's summer camp. Police in another Texas town take on a man who they believe was bent on doing some serious harm and COVID concert cancellation. At least one Rolling Stones show is on hold after Mick Jagger gets his COVID test back.